starting my epic time to go day five. And uh, hopefully it's not gonna be as windy, but uh, it's gonna be light winds when I take off and then it's gonna get really strong winds as I get towards California. I am headed to Barstow, California today from Flagstaff, Arizona. Uh, you can see the fires over here. It's uh, moving uh, massive winds last night. Uh, kind of kept me awake all night. I thought my bike was gonna flip over. I had it uh, here in a corner, so it uh, wasn't gonna get a lot of wind, but it got a lot of wind. I'm just grateful it didn't tip over. Okay, I'm off on my journey. I uh, dropped my phone, cracked my screen today, but uh, hopefully that's all that happens. Okay, I am in Needles, California. I made it to California. Woo! Gas is seven dollars and nine cents a gallon, and uh, everything's super expensive here. But it's uh, 85 degrees and uh, complete sun in the desert of the Mojave Desert right now. That's where I'm at. So unbelievable people live here. But uh, I wonder what made Needles Needles. I don't know. I'm gonna. I'll find out. Made it to Bartstow, California today. Got to 90 some degrees in the desert, and uh, in the last 30 miles got super windy. It's probably windy right now when I'm talking to you, but uh, I made it and uh, rest up and got a big three days coming up. So uh, keep it up. Starting day six of the adventure, I'm going from Barstool, California, to Mojave, California. I think that's how you pronounce it, but to the uh, Rawhide Adventures uh, Adventure Days. So we're gonna see what happens, and I'll keep you updated along the journey. Hey, 
I have made it to uh, Mojave, California. Let's go to Rawhide Adventures and go check it out. And we'll spend a couple days here. If you can see ahead of me, there are wind turbines as far as you can see in the mountains which means they got a lot of wind here. Look at the wind turbines that they have. It's unbelievable how many wind turbines they have on those mountains. You get outside the city, which is really small, it is desert. It is desert, sand. And uh, that's what you get. It's getting windy now, I can feel it. I felt it all the way here, but uh, it's getting even windier. Tell, but uh, the wind is pretty strong, it's blowing me pretty good. This uh, camera on my front of my helmet is not the greatest with wind, to be honest with you. When there's a wind coming across your face like this, it hits the camera. Hey. How you doing? I'm doing great, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. Oh. Oh, was your ride? From Michigan, it was pretty, pretty brutal. Pretty brutal, huh? Huh? Windy. Snowing. Oh. Rained. Oh, right. One day was uh, eight hours of rain. You got the whole deal, huh? Everything. And then this wind has been brutal. It's windy out here. It definitely gets windy. It does. So I um, I have a tent, but well, then you go ahead and uh, go and check in. That's okay. There's a one tent to your left here. <laughs> That campground, that, that camp that we got there with the wall, it's a big square, and that's where all the motorcycles and tents are. Basically. Okay. So you can go in there and put your bike in there, set up a tent if you're gonna tent tomorrow. And What's that? Well, I was. I'm going, no, I'm, no, no, actually I brought my stuff to do that, but this morning when I turned on the weather and it said 60 mile an hour winds, I'm like, comfort in. Oh, okay. So I got, my parking there or there. Oh. Okay, hey, I got a question for you. I got a class at two o'clock. I would be 100% on that. After you check, after you bike, park your bike, you get your, your badge, your lanyard right there. Yep. Check in, they'll give you your lanyard, give you all your stuff. Okay. And then they can direct you at what time uh, the class will be. Do they have a full? If you have an iPhone or whatever, scan here. Okay. Your class. There. I'm just... Weedness. Adventure days. I made it all the way from Michigan through rain, snow, wind, cold. We made it. We're here. There's a uh, all the boozer back here. There's a tent city over there, which uh, is a walled compound, and that's where I was going to be. But um, what I did decided to do was uh, stay at a comfort in tonight so didn't have to deal with the uh, wind anyways we'll see how it goes tent back there you can have RVs and uh, there's a main stage up there and uh, starting off my journey all right so I'm at the main area of Rawhide Adventure Days this is where the vendor booths are so if you guys are with me you could be here and see it, but uh, this is what it looks like. So, all the vendors are. The fire pit right there. This is where their dinner is, I guess. I don't know where the main stage is, but that's where I have to be. So it must be somewhere over here where the main stage is. All right, we're on Get On ADV Fest. Right there. Uh, enjoy the day. The entire weekend's activities, everything from dinner time to uh, to when the bar opens, etc. So, um, a few other things.